The NBA is no stranger to controversies and conflicting opinions. The league's superstars not only shine on the court, but also wield significant influence off it. Among them, LeBron James has been a central figure for over a decade, attracting both admiration and criticism. Recently, statements from ENE's Cantor Freedom and other former players have sparked a new controversy. Cantor has accused LeBron of being a dictator within the NBA, controlling the league and punishing those who defy him. But before we dive into the details, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give us a thumbs up. Your support means the world to us and keeps us motivated to bring you the best content. Ianese Cantor Freedom, a former NBA player known for both his on-court performance and off-court activism, is no stranger to controversy. Recently, Cantor made an explosive statement claiming that Los Angeles Lakers superstar LeBron James acts like a dictator within the NBA. According to Cantor, LeBron controls everything within the league, and those who dare to contradict him quickly find themselves on the trading block. Cantor has been particularly harsh on LeBron after his son, Bronny James, signed with the Los Angeles Lakers without having stood out in the NCAA. He may be a good guy, but he's not good enough to play in the NBA. The reason he was drafted is because of LeBron. The reason J.J. Redick is the coach is because of LeBron, he declared. The former Fenerbahce, Utah Jazz, Oklahoma City Thunder, New York Knicks, Portland Trailblazers, and Boston Celtics player also denounced that when the Lakers' season fails, LeBron tries to find a player to blame. He already blamed the entire season on Russell Westbrook, so he's not a good teammate. Cantor's accusations against LeBron James went further. He runs the media and tries to control the narrative. But when you really get to know and have a conversation within the NBA and its players, no one wants to play with him. When I see a dictator, I recognize him. LeBron is literally like the dictator of the NBA. He controls the media, he controls his narrative. If you go against him, you get traded. Everyone knows it, explained Cantor, who cannot enter Turkey after his harsh criticism of President Recep Tayyip Erdogan, calling him the Hitler of our century. In the last few weeks during the NBA Summer League, James has been accused of using his influence in the Lakers to promote his son, Bronny, whose talent is beginning to be questioned. Cantor's strong statements have sparked debate among fans and analysts, raising questions about the true extent of LeBron's influence in the league and its implications for players and teams. Whether Cantor's allegations hold weight or not, they undoubtedly add another layer to the ongoing discourse surrounding LeBron James's legacy, both on and off the court. Moving on to the second piece of news, an NBA star has a clear opinion on Bronny James, stating, I don't think Bronny James is a professional. Jalen Brown is clear that Bronny James doesn't have what it takes to be a professional. The Boston Celtics star attended the summer league game between the Celtics and the Lakers, featuring LeBron's son, and his doubts about the young point guard were apparent from his lips. I don't think Bronny is a professional, the forward said with Chicago Sky players Kaisri Gundrezic and Angel Reese at his side. Several United States media outlets reported that this is what Brown, recently proclaimed an NBA champion with Boston, said. I think he'll be on the G League team for sure, Gondrezic responded. According to Clutch Points, I don't think about it. I don't think about it because his name will be on the Lakers, Brown reportedly replied. Despite the buzz around his signing, Bronny James is expected to debut with the purple and gold, allowing LeBron to fulfill his dream of playing with his son. However, the point guard will likely spend most of the season on the G League team, the South Bay Lakers. Either way, Jalen Brown's words are sure to stir up some discussion. The pressure on Bronny James is immense. Not only must he deal with the expectations that come with the James name, but also with the reality that his every move is closely watched and analyzed. This pressure can be a determining factor in his development as a player. To better understand Jalen Brown's skepticism, it is helpful to consider the level of competition in the NBA. Every year, thousands of talented youngsters aspire to join the league, but only a few manage to do so. The NBA requires not only exceptional technical and athletic skills, but also not universally well-received. At the same time, expectations for Bronny underscore the unique challenges facing the children of sports superstars. Ultimately, these discussions reveal the diverse perspectives and opinions that exist on the NBA's most prominent figures. The influence of LeBron James and the future of Bronny 
will be topics of continued interest to basketball fans and experts for years to come. Jalen Brown's statements about Bronny James highlight the often harsh realities of professional basketball. While Bronny has the potential and tools to go far, him and Jalen Brown's statements. Do you agree with them? Share your thoughts and opinions in the comments below. Remember, our channel celebrates the legends of the game and the incredible stories behind them. Stay tuned for more great content, and as always, keep the passion for sports alive. See you in the next video.